Hey, what's up YouTube? This is King Rancher 13. What we got going on today is working on uh, Customers 2020. And it is platinum. It's got a six inch super lift with King coilover adjustable shocks. And we're gonna be going through and putting some switches in and um, working on the computer and things like that. Thank y'all so much for 1,000 subscribers. Came really quick. I think a lot of y'all have been enjoying some of the content I've been putting up on our channel. Let me know down in the comments below what other things you wanna see. But for now, uh, we're gonna get working on this truck. That's a very good question. Yeah, I got the... What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 You hear that turbo spool up? Yeah. That's what I was missing. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Here, what give I... it give it a little throttle. Let's hear it. Golly. Hey, it smells like diesel. Yeah, so sorry about the space between videos it's been crazy busy here lately i'm actually going to take two days off my offices will be closed my phone lines will be down um, please leave messages and emails and stuff with me and i'll get back to y'all as soon as i can i've just had hundreds of inquiries every day about this truck about just any other parts list wheels tires and all that stuff so number one i appreciate the support and number two if y'all can please hit that like and subscribe if you haven't already and like us on facebook and follow us on instagram at outdoor.trucks and at king rancher 13 but anyways i'm gonna take two days off uh and i'm gonna go on another road trip i'm at already seven thousand miles on this baby in over just a little bit over a month so time for an oil change uh at the dealership I'm, I'm gonna just go ahead and use my ford pass points because i've got that and i got my boy jerry at the dealership that i used to work with he's gonna detail it up for me before i go on my trip we do have a couple things coming up here next week uh actually we've got i'm spending a lot of money i've got one two three parts to put on this truck and we'll be putting those on here soon and then I also sneak peek I've got something for my buddy's Josh's truck again so stay tuned guys much needed wash best guys right here what's up <laughs> best guys right here what's going on Jerry the man oh, yeah. crap I might have to get you to wash it again after I get back from my trip <laughs> Every, every two weeks, please. Every two weeks you want it? All right. All right, so done getting the truck all detailed up. Now I've got to pull into the shop here, um, getting the oil change. Got Daniel, he's getting the oil for me because the quick lane, they were all um, pretty busy and backed up. 
Daniel, how bad is it that I waited until about 7,000 miles for my first oil change? It's not bad. You know, Ford says 10, but yeah. 7 ain't bad. Yeah, usually on the first one, I wanted to do it at two or 3,000 just yeah. because got, it's the you first. Got, you got braking oil in there, so right. it, it's, it's really, you want to do it early, but yeah. I mean, looking at the oil right now, it's pretty, it's not that diluted, so I'd say you're doing fine. Okay. But I just didn't have any time to come by here. Actually, I tried to come by here two weeks ago, and Quick Lane was all jammed up. Oh, and, you're fine, dude. So. Your oil is very, uh, looks pretty healthy compared to the other ones we do at this mileage. Yeah, that's so good. I, I'd say you did fine. Cool. You know, I try to drive easy as possible. Yeah. Even June, I mean, it's impressive that it's not really that dirty. It's black, but you can still see it. Clear in the, in right, the viscosity exactly. is pretty good. Yeah. It's not gritty or nothing. Yeah, that's awesome. What year is that King Ranger there? Uh, 13. 13. Yeah, so they're pretty rebuild. Yeah, talk about your truck. Got a new intake coming in next week. Looks pretty good, Sammy, don't it? It's all stock still. Except for the bottom. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I do a lot of driving. <laughs> About and what kind of oil are you put in here? 10W30 uh, motorcraft. 10W30 motorcraft. Yeah, that's all Motorcraft's I, all I run. Yeah, they built this engine around that oil. So. Oh, really? Wow. All right, ready to go? Half court. Half court, okay. Got another one pulled up. FYI, these tires are awful. We were just talking about they throw gravel like no other. These people are like, oh, mud tires, they throw so much rocks and stuff. No. Especially on the mud grass, the space and all is big enough to where they don't really catch anything. Half of the court. Oh, yeah. How's that look? Spot on? Oh, yeah. All right, a good deal. All right. All right. Thanks for the oil change, Daniel. And Chris, wherever he went. Wherever. But he's going to get on the road now. From the oil change, came here to Lake Charles, Louisiana. Uh, what's the place called? La LaBerge. La 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 Eloy reached out to me on Instagram, and I technically wasn't supposed to be on Instagram. I just visited it because a guy I was eating dinner with wanted to see a picture of my truck, and so I pulled it up, and then uh, Eloy had messaged me and said, uh, if I, asking me if I was here. I was like, I don't want to be that guy, but I think you're here. So anyways, him and his son uh, met up with me at the lobby, and we came out here to the truck and you know just looked around at it and just shooting the bull here. But anyways, thanks so much for watching, y'all. Please make sure to comment down below and let me know uh, what else you want to see and if you enjoyed the video. For now, peace out, guys. Take care. Later, guys. Bye. <laughs>